All right, guys, tomorrow's finally opening day of, or the first day of youth season tomorrow. And uh, I'm taking a couple of my friends from my school and my basketball team. Um, they're actually twins. This one's Tate, this one's Cole. And uh, we sh just shot the shotgun quite a bit. And now we're gonna go see who gets the first shot at turkey tomorrow. So we're gonna get a basketball and see however many you can, they can make out of like 10 shots from a certain point, so. You guys both warm up. You guys don't warm up. Okay. So, so yeah, we'll shoot 10 out of 10 here. Both you guys start wins that, and we'll do out of 10 there, out of 10 there, and whoever wins out of three. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh no! Ugh. One out of four. Mm. <laughs> oh no! <laughs> <laughs> so you made no, okay. so you made eight, nine, and then five out of ten. Okay. Here we go, Tate. Two for three. Alright. Oh snap. What's that? Seven. Six or seven? Yeah. Seven, eight, seven, eight. Okay. Oh. All right, so Cole won, so he gets the first shot at the turkey tomorrow. But we got a couple options. We got a public land area. Even my dad scouted the other day that we've heard quite a few birds on. And then we got a good spot here, just across from our house here. That's a good spot too. So we're gonna um, eat real quick. Then we're gonna go try to roost some birds tonight. So stay tuned. <laughs> Looking good. Yeah, it feels like it's 40 degrees. There's no wind. It's like awesome. Hopefully it's like this tomorrow morning. It's pretty good. No red. A little pink, not too bad though. I'm sure right. Rex would eat it. Rex would eat it. Oh man, I can't wait for a while. It's gonna be so sweet. I hope they're over there. I don't know why they wouldn't be.
yeah, these birds are either roosted like 80 yards off the roost, like right there, or they're like not not gonna be by us at all. Not even in the county. Well, I mean, we heard one guy last night, and he's probably 300, 400 yards away, and now foul field, we think. We'll chase. Them.
That's right. That's right, stone gun. Good on, buddy. Let's go. Let's go. Good shooting. Oh my gosh, man. I was afraid he's going to come like five feet away from me. He was. Did you see him? Is he like right by you? Oh my gosh, I, I just closed my eyes and did this. Oh my god. Oh, that was insane. Oh man, who shot the second time? That was Tate. But oh, I got you. I had him on right there. He was I running all over the place. He was running all over the place. I know. He had him the I, I first time. He, he was I know, right I on the thing. He's not moving, but then the safety is on. on. He's safety. like, oh shoot. It's already too quick. Well, I put it on safety it. because he told me. Let's go get But he smacked that decoy, dude. Oh, did you get a film? Oh, yeah. <laughs> I, there's a little bit of brush here, but I think it all focused good. Yeah. That was textbook, dude. <laughs> <laughs> Opening morning and youth season in Missouri. Let's go. Oh, it's so cool. <laughs> A, B, and X laying everywhere, man. <laughs> oh, that, I didn't think it was going to happen. We heard gobbles everywhere for the first like 30 minutes. I was sitting there. And I, was like, I was like, man, I wonder where they're going to come from. And I was like, what's that noise? coming from over <laughs> like, crunch, 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 like, everywhere. I know. We had a hen sitting up in this tree and she flew down. Power of youth season, dude. You can call them from anywhere. I kept on hearing them. Oh, it sounds yeah. so good. How long did that take? I don't know. What time is it now? Like, way too early. <laughs> <laughs> it's one of the quickest turkey hunts I've ever been on. That's <laughs> yeah. It's what? 6.57. I wish they were all that easy. I know. Man, that second one. If that dude wasn't flopping at all. So oh, yeah. yeah. If you would have started flopping immediately, that other one had no clue what was going on. Like, I was sitting right here. Dude. He walked by me right here. Yes, he did. He walked right up through here. He did. Like right past these trees and literally just up into the food plot. He went up to the side oh, of the man. brush, and then he kind of went back and he went through the brush and just dragged. He's a good bird, man. So I was running and I was hit the decoy and I was like, I know. <laughs> it scared me too. I mean, he, he just, oh, that was so awesome, dude. It never gets me old. <laughs> Oh, this might not work the best. Here, grab this like and just like kind of punch it up there. Uh, <laughs> no, no, with the spur, with the spur. Yeah, yeah, we got to. All right, now, our April, let's punch it. Sweet. All right, now go. All right, that's good. Perfect. Perfect. <laughs> that wasn't cool. No double beard. That's all right. Still, that's got a broom coming off of him, man. Yeah. That's service right there. He's coming all the way down here. Sweet. Awesome. Perfect. Stink and go. That was so fun.
drop this one off and go get another. <laughs> All right, guys, we took the turkey back, dropped it off, got something to eat real quick. Actually, we didn't really eat anything. <laughs> got something to drink and then back out here. We're back at a, another place we have permission to turkey hunt. It's right next to Darland here, and it's a pretty nice place. My mom came back here this morning and listened for turkeys, and she said she heard um, lots of birds really close to the property line or whatever. So she said she heard two way down at the end of this, so we're going to walk down there and see if we can't strike something up. It's kind of a bad time right now. It's like 7 o'clock, isn't there, or something? Let's see. They're probably going to be hinned up, but we'll see. Yeah, it's 8 o'clock already. So, we're going to go down here and see if you can't strike anything up. And we've got a couple other places we're trying to um, go look for some turkeys today. So, hey, girl, girl. Okay, we're good. Go down real slow. Go down real slow. There's never a turkey strike here. Just about 80, 90 yards right down here is a big old golfer strut. So I don't see any hens with them. Careful. We're gonna back up really so hey, keep your gun down. Way too far, you don't want to get real close. 
Don't shoot mosquitoes. I'm just gonna stay steady. Alright guys, so we went back to the house, got something to eat and stuff, and we got back out here and we're going around cruising around these public land areas and trying to strike some up, up and we just got out of the truck back there and Jacob hit his mouth with a call, a couple putts and stuff, and one got fired up, or one gobbled um, on this one ridge over here, it's a ways away, but we're circling around the, circling around the other side of him and seeing if we can get be a little closer to him, but it's like, Two o'clock right now, but I'm kind of surprised he gobbled and stuff. We should. We may not get him to do it again. Yeah, I don't know. He seemed pretty fired up, but just gobbling to that. I yeah. Mean, that was pretty good, but we're going to head around here and see if we can get him to gobble again. Yeah. 
Pound Tom, but still. No. <laughs> yeah. I don't know how big he would have been, but it would have been big. Yeah, when we got back to the truck, and we're thinking that bird might have spooked from like the, because like the, the sun was shining on my the AVX or whatever, and it was like really shiny and like looked really weird. And you wouldn't think that bother them gobblers, but like these, especially these like old um, public land gobblers, they've been they've been shot at probably, they've been called in several times and stuff. So they're probably just really smart, but we're not 100% sure, but it could have been a coyote, it could have been probably a decoy, but we're not for sure. But we're gonna head back to the house and try to get the birds on the way up to roost tonight, hopefully. All right guys, we're heading out tonight. We've got a good idea where these birds are gonna roost tonight. Back behind my house where uh, uh, we had a big old group of birds midday today that were working and got take out a shot at one but they kind of calmed back down and stuff so we're gonna head back here and see if we can't get on these birds on the way to roost. Right, guys thanks for watching um unfortunately tate never got on a turkey um he had a couple shots that he missed but 
they're kind of tough shots, especially um, with the shotgun and a uh, little experience he had. But I plan on taking him regular season and seeing if I can't get him on turkey then. But otherwise, I got four or five other good turkey gun videos coming, so stay tuned for those. But um, that's going to be the end of this video, so see you next time. Peace.